onward. We have a rich rest of the program. Uh, and uh, the first of it, I went to this uh, event where I was speaking, and Miranda Rondeau got up and with that, you know, oh, she has her little drum and right, whoa! <laughs> so, so when we were doing this, Miranda, would you do that drum? And not only do sing it, whatever, but explain a little how the sounds happen. So I give you, Mar she's very big in the steel drum thing, and she'll tell you about the history of it. It has a huge, you know, wonderful history. Uh, so I give you the fabulous Miranda Rondeau. Testing, testing. Testing, there we go. archetypal instruments on the planet. It's the frame drum. The frame drum is any drum where the head is larger than the depth of its shell. It's found on almost every continent, and many cultures will have their own styles, techniques, songs, and rhythms on the drum. Uh, this, discovering this drum actually changed my life. Uh, when I grew up, I uh, had the belief that it was uh, accursed to be born a woman. Um, as a child, I believed uh, the, in the collective thought that women were inferior, women were less than, and I looked for the evidence of that. There's, there's no women presidents, there's no women doctors, and, and so on. And um, when I discovered my teacher, Elaine Redman, uh, she's a master frame drummer, and she also wrote a book called When the Drummers Were Women, A Spiritual History of Rhythm and she discovered um, a whole history in the middle Mediterranean area of uh, women frame drummers. And I saw her do this slide presentation show, and in these slides, uh, many, many pictures of frame drummers that happened to be the women, uh, carvings on cave walls, and carvings on temple walls in Egypt, figurines, paintings on vases, and pottery. And when I saw this, uh, it was a homecoming. It was like finding the missing piece um, to my life. It brought on a whole new vocabulary about women, women as sacred vessel for all of life to come through. The symbols on the drum were lotuses representing the sacred womb. And there began my journey to embracing my own womanhood and seeing women as sacred. Uh, the first song we ever hear is the sound of the our mother's blood pulsing through her arteries while we were fetuses in the womb. For nine, so for nine months, we resonated to the heartbeat of the mother. In some Native American cultures, a drum is referred to the sound of the Holy Mother. 
Also, what's、um, awesome about the drum is that when you play, the vibrations come right back to you. And Lane Redman had passed on that the drum strokes are related to the elements, and she had it passed down from Hamza Eldin, a Nubian musician, frame drummer. And the lowest sound of the drum is doom, related to the element water. And water is a part of our body, 75% or more, and as well as on the earth. What would we do without water?、Um, when you muffle the drum, it's ka, related to the element earth. Earth, our one home. Earth, our mother, who gives us everything. Tech on the edge of the drum is、uh, related to fire, the sun, and the energy in our body. What would happen if we didn't have the sun? And then there's the brushing of the drum, and that's related to air, our breath. So these are all sacred things that are make up our body and make up the whole, our whole universe. So the drum now becomes the whole cosmos for me. It's also the circle, unity, oneness, wholeness. And it's the sun and the moon for me, and so this helps me remember what is sacred and what is important. And I'm going to share a song called "Dragonfly,"、um, representing transformation. And I just did a music video a year ago, which added my、uh, way of honoring the frame drum and what it means to me, and also honoring the women, past and present, who play these instruments, because there's a time period. Um, where the women were not allowed to play the drum anymore, and they built churches on top of the goddess temples.、Um, those figurines that were in the images in the slideshow、uh, research was that they were either、uh, representations of the goddess or the priestesses that、um, worshipped the goddess. And the drum was used.、Um, the priestesses it, they were responsible for the religious functions of society. So, in honor of all of them.